Hey guys, hopefully we're on. Yeah, we hope. We hope. Mics say they're on, they're moving. That's good. The video looks like it's there, but we're gonna see if it pops up here. We're not Trying. sitting in the car, but we're gonna call it that. Correct. <laughs> So bear with us here. I'm trying to get Sean's little comments up since we're not in the car. Yeah. Do, 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 do. So it doesn't look. Hey, Renee, how's it going? Hi, Renee. So I'm trying to get, I don't know what's going on with Sean's computer. He cannot switch over to my account. And so he cannot monitor questions. Mm -mm. Hey Mel, hey Jordan, hey, how's it all going? Thank you. Um, so welcome to Ken from the Car. I'm going to yes. give you guys a quick little few minutes to pop in. We are super late. I have a reason for that. Everything's kind of crazy today. We'll get into all of that. Um, but I think you need to restart your computer. I don't know what to tell yeah, you, Mr. Just doesn't like it. It doesn't like it. Hey guys, how's it going? How's it going? So you... Restart that or figure yeah, that out. I'll figure that one out. All right. So, hey, how's it going? So, I'm going to get some stuff pulled up here while he does that. So, normally we don't do Ken from the car using Switcher Studios, but we are today because we want to talk to you about... Um, here, I'll let you do that. Yep. Uh, it's doing a restart. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> there it goes. Here comes my little apple. But I've learned not to question Sean, not to yell at Sean, not to make a bad face at Sean, <laughs> not to say anything to Sean because I get attacked in my own comments. <laughs> so Did I'm very careful what I do. Hey, hey guys. All right. Yes, it is Ken from the basement today. So uh, let me first tell you guys why I am so late with this. So there was actually a Chalk Couture all day kind of retreat meeting and it just got over. Mm -hmm. So I said, we are going to go live. Plus we are also supposed to go live on Chalk Couture later, mm -hmm. but I didn't want you guys to miss the Ken from the car. So we are going to chat about a lot of stuff. Um, but I need Sean to be able to monitor comments. Yep. Oh, Sean has not done his computer update. That's why. And voila, there's that. I can't with you. Oh, I didn't do anything. I can't with you. All right, guys. So, sorry, I just am going to be sharing my desktop, so he needs to be able to see all of our questions. I don't know what your deal is. I think you have to manage your Google account, so we won't be able to use your computer today. Wah, wah. So, I won't be able to monitor all your questions. I'll have some questions and stuff. Hi, Anne. How's it going? Hello, everyone. Normally, I'd be able to also monitor your stuff up on my little phone, but I can't do that. So, all right guys, so let's go ahead and jump in. So I'm gonna go over, if you've never been to a Ken from the car, um, yes, we know there's a lot of headroom, but there's a reason for that. Okay, so if you've never been to a Ken from the car, we talk about deals, we talk about cool announcements coming up, we talk about some really fun stuff um, and kind of how our week went. I have a lot of stuff I need to talk about and air out because I'm this close to shaving my head like Britney Spears, so that's fun. Um, so, yay. Uh, so we're gonna talk about that. First, we are gonna talk to you guys about our new team member. So we have recently this week added a new team member. He's trying to get on live too. Everyone thinks they know how to fix this, but they don't. So let's do this. It's, it's something to do with your Google account. That's all. Hmm. I'll figure it out. We can't use it. It's so sad. Um, so let me introduce him. So basically, here is the big deal before I introduce him. Also, if you've never seen Ken from the car, I can't keep on my focus. So just be That's prepared. Okay. So um, I'm at a crossroads with this channel. For those of you who guys don't know, um, as Chocotor takes off and that's where my passion is, I've been being pulled in that direction. And I had to separate my channels and do a Ken from the car, or not a Ken from the car, Ken's Creations and a Chalk Couture channel. And guess what? It has doubled all the work for. <laughs> it was horrible. It was crazy. <laughs> and so now I'm monitoring all these pages. So 
Um, as you guys know, I want to start bringing a lot of stuff here. And I'm going to be asking for your input on some of it on what kind of videos you want to see because we might be taking this whole channel in a whole new different direction, but it won't be until the first of the year. But until then, Sean needs some help filming and editing and voiceover. Right. So we, I will let you introduce who is here to help you. All right. And why he is also going to be here because you're going to be t training him on stuff like yes. this. So without further ado, Mr. Ryan. Hi guys. Hess. Does he look familiar? A little bit? This is actually Kenny's nephew from his brother that's one up. Yes, yes. And Did you purposely put him in a gray shirt? <laughs> no, I didn't even realize you were in the gray shirt. Oh my shirt. gosh, except for he's super tall and I'm yeah. super short. Now you know how to move over. Now so this over. is my nephew, Ryan. Um, you have to move over. Um, so he is working here with Sean to help mm -hmm. edit and voiceover and all sorts of stuff, mm -hmm. um, which is good because I've now decided in my life that Sean and I should not probably work together because we might kill each other because... Yeah. Please, you get so frustrated with me and I get frustrated with you, but <laughs> nobody ever says, oh, Sean, you're so mean to Kenny. He just waits till the cameras are off, you guys. <laughs> but ask Jasmine. Just ask Jasmine or Jessica or my friend Ali. I'm just saying. Ryan will see it too eventually. Uh, you will. I, I try to be. I'm always nice. Or at least try to be. I can't tell. Uh, I can't with you. All right, He's guys. always nice. Freeman, he's always nice to me. Always, always, always. That is not true, Every guys. I will even admit when I'm frustrated and I go to Jasmine and I'm like, hey, yeah. I probably need to be upstairs because if not, tomorrow you're going to have to help me hide a body. Mm. So, <laughs> <laughs> so anyways, um, we, uh, Ryan is here and already doing a whole bunch of videos, mm -hmm. um, which brings me up to my next uh, thing about, uh, let's show him what I can from the car. So he's gonna be training on Switcher Studios today, mm -hmm. so he's gonna go over there with you. Yep. Let's chat. If you guys have questions, it will be a little bit hard because I am trying to navigate how to do this without doing it just for my car, so that's fun. Um, so, uh, let's talk about Cricut sale. So I am obsessed with this sale and the reason I titled it the way I did is you guys need to take advantage of the sale. It's Cricut Maker Anniversary Sale. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's about up to 52% off. And when I say it that way, it's because Cricut lets you combine coupons. So this is the time to take advantage of sales. I'm sure you guys are hearing it from other product, um, Cricket uh, affiliates and stuff, they do this every once in a while, but basically, essentially, for the most part, all tools and materials are 40% off. Mm -hmm. If you're a Cricut Access member, which you should be because it's 10% off, um, and 90,000 images, you get another 10% off, and then, so on and so forth, you get yeah. another 10% off with my coupon code, Ken. Sweet. Yes, and if you guys, um, use the code. It does help support this channel, which I don't know if you know this, but we have a new team member and I already told them that if we don't get enough sales, we'll have to let him go. <laughs> yeah, Ryan. And it's not Ryan, it's Sean. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh. What? All right, guys, so I am going to, I'm going to show you guys, um, Quickly, the number one, after I always say about sales, I get a bazillion and a half comments mm -hmm. on the code's not working or why is this not working? So I wanted to show you guys how to do this and then we're gonna talk about this channel and we're gonna talk about some other stuff. I'm super mm -hmm. excited. And then we're immediately gonna be going over to my Chocotour channel and doing a Chocotour live there. So I'm super excited. So I'm gonna share my uh, screen. You'll see it pop right which, up Which uh, you guys will see on the crate. Now when I'm sharing the screen, you guys okay. will not, I will not be able to see your comments. So I do apologize. Okay. Nice. Um, oh yes, don't you worry. We're gonna talk about that little mini easy press thingy. Um, okay, so first of all, let's just talk about the sale. So it is the Cricut Maker Anniversary Sale. And essentially, essentially I'm gonna tell you a couple tricks that I always do too. But if you go to the sale page, I will get this comment all the time. Ken, you said tools are 40% off and it's not. I only see materials. Just because it's not listed on this page, guys, doesn't mean it's not on sale. So if you go to accessories and look at, let's say, for example, um, pens, and you look at pens, ah, oh, they're on sale. Now, they might be a different percentage off or something, but they are on sale. First tip I wanna show you guys is make sure whenever you're going to a specific 
page, so let's say tool sets, um, you're sorting by the newest arrival. This will show you what has brand new spanking hit the table, like this gray set, which I'm super excited for. I don't know why, because it's just gray, but it's like manly. And I'm very manly. I like that. <laughs> so, um, so how this sale works is essentially, let's talk about machines. Machines right now are, Cricut Maker is basically the lowest I've seen it, $30 off. We have Cricut Explore Air 2, Cricut Easy Press as low as $99, but where it comes to live is the materials. Vinyl is 40% off. And once again, I can't stress it enough, guys, always sort by new, newest arrival. This is gonna be your new, new stuff, okay? So let's say um, I have a whole bunch of stuff in my cart. So let's just go ahead and, and go to the cart right now. Everyone will always skip the first screen because they'll do checkout. Instead of doing that, hit your cart and hit view my cart. This will actually bring up the cart. Here it is. And you can see all of my discounts are reflecting. So 10% off because I'm a Cricut Access member, okay? But if you go to the next, which is check out, it's going to have me sign in and do all that great jazz. That's where you will be able to use a promotion code, which is Ken, the K-E-N. Um, I do... So down here, you can already see I applied it, but this is where, if let's say we were to take off my discount code, you can see right there, it's still giving me the premium 10% off, um, all of that stuff. You're gonna put in Ken, just K-E-N, it gives you that other 10% off. And it will figure out what it is applied to. So Cricut's website is smart enough to know, hey, we're not gonna let you use the code on mm -hmm. you know certain things. But here is this, what I love about this sale, you guys, is the percentage off. So I'm addicted to this paper. That's why it's in my cart. It's by the Happy and um, Rad and Happy. I love them. Cool I love it. Dude, you guys, these are normally $12, right? So I have, let's, let's put, here's another thing about my code is you have to have $50 or more in your cart. So that's why I have two of each in here. I don't really need two of each, but that way you guys, it has to be a subtotal. So I'm not even there. That's why I have to do three of each. But essentially, this stuff is already from $12 down to $11.90, or it's $11.99 down to $7.19. So let's already do the math, right? Okay? Okay, Sean? Okay. So it, it starts off at $12. I have three of each in my cart, right? Times three. So I'm spending $108 is what the normal cart would be, $108. Correct. With discounts uh, before Ken, it's sixty four seventy one. So that's just on sale. It's went from one hundred eight dollars down to sixty four dollars, right? Nice. If you're a Cricut Access member, you get ten percent off and free shipping. If you use Ken, it gives you another ten percent off, which is a combined discount of twelve dollars and twenty nine cents. So what was originally one hundred and eight dollars is now. We have to actually minus the tax because most people don't, some people don't have to pay tax. So it would be 5701, it would be 60, let's see, 6471, right? Minus the 1229, it would be $52.42. Normally $108. That's almost $52. So yeah, so I just wanted you guys to see how to do that. Mm -hmm. um, I'm gonna go back to your comments. I get super excited about this sale because um, the code is super easy. It is Ken, K-E-N. So if you are on Facebook, all of your links are above and the coupon code is just K-E-N. Oops, I didn't like that. Ken. So um, make sure to use the links and K-E-N. Now, you need to be Cricut Access to get that other 10% off. So if you're not a Cricut Access member, you're gonna want to subscribe first, mm -hmm. check out, then go back in and put stuff in your cart. There you go. So easy peasy. it is easy peasy, right? Okay, so let's talk about, um, of course, what's on sale and uh, what you can get, and then we're gonna talk about this Easy Press because I will be honest. Um, so first of all, Everyone is saying, Ken, why aren't you showing it? I am no longer a Cricut product expert, so I was not notified, obviously, that this was even coming out. So I found out 
after actually everyone we were in a live when people were like have you seen the mini press and i was like they don't know what they're talking about sean there is no mini press and <laughs> then we got off the live and i was like oh sean there's a mini press look at it oh, um so i wanted to talk about it because i will admit you guys um when i first saw it i thought "Ooh, i i kind of feel like cricket's being a little price grabby because it's expensive i think it's let's share, share it was it's sixty nine ninety nine, I believe. Um, let me look it up really quick. See, I don't, and I, I'm gonna be honest, guys. I haven't tested it. I haven't played with it. I don't even know any specs on it. So I am literally learning it as you guys are on different sites and stuff. Mm -hmm. um, so it's right here. It is super cute. Sixty nine ninety nine. Um, it is coming out on my birthday, just so you know, September sixth. 2019 I will be 29 years old just so you guys know at first I was like ooh, that's a little expensive because a lot of people were saying Ken I can get a tinier like a little basically little iron on Amazon or you know different places um, so it's a little expensive and I was like yeah it is it kind of is mm -hmm. yeah. I have not tested it I want to test it um, the one thing I will say if it's like anything of Cricut's products it's going to be high quality the mm -hmm. even temperature, that's the reason I love the easy presses. Yes, you can buy a home iron for dirt cheap, but it doesn't have that nice, consistent, um, even, heat. even heat. The other thing I'm hearing is there is an extra coat coating of basically non uh, stick material on this that makes it glide and slide. Oh, nice. Glide and slide, baby. And um, this is gonna be good for like shoes and bows. I don't make shoes, I don't make bows. Um, so when I saw it, I didn't see, I'm like, what am I going to do with that? That's going to take me forever to press a shirt. <laughs> but then someone was yes. like, I'm so excited because I'm going to be able to put initials on stuffed animals. And I was like, oh my gosh, yes, I can put stuff on hats. I can put stuff on stuff. So am I excited now about it? Yes. yes. Okay, I mean, let's be honest. Makes I, it makes sense. Yeah. So let's get that out of the way. I'm super excited for it. Once I get it, these guys are already planning the review. Um, but I do want to really quickly go over again the sale for you guys and then we're going to talk about some other stuff. What is on sale? So machine tools are on sale with the exception of the maker tools. Those are not on sale, but even your basic machine tools. So stock up on your fine tip blade, stock up on um, your deep cut blades. All of those are on sales. We have your pens are on sales and there is some really nice new Martha Stewart pens. They were out of stock. I don't know if they're back in stock and they're already on sale. There they are, $7.79. These I do believe were exclusive to Michaels and now they are on the site. So you definitely want to check those out. I always get machine mats when they are on sale. So I cannot stress it enough. My favorite go-to mat, you guys, is the blue mat. Um, so I always, always stock up on mats when they are on sale. So the light grip right here is my go-to guy. Love him, you need him. Uh, the self-healing mats are on sale. Now, self-healing mats, at first I didn't use them a lot, but these are great prices. You get the mat, you get the um, non-slip uh, ruler, and then you get a true control blade, which I'm telling you guys is sharp. So be very careful with it. Mm -hmm. um, but all of these are on sale. All of your easy press mats are on sale at the 40% off. But the category that gets Ken in trouble is the materials. Let's talk about that. This is the one that I end up spending hundreds of dollars on and Sean just looks the other way. So vinyl, 40% off. So this is even their new vinyl. This is their brand new um, repositionable, not positionable. It also has some exclusive Martha colors that haven't been on there before. So you have this beautiful Oceanside Ceremony. Uh, you have the brand new mosaics that everyone is in love with. You have anything on here, they're all on sale. Once again, always click that newest arrival. I can't see your comments and questions, I do apologize. Iron-on is also 40% uh, off. Yeah. So it can get up to 52% off, because once again, uh, you know, we'll add some stuff in the cart just so you can see how big of a difference this can make in your, your carts. This is when you want to take advantage of Cricut sales. Um, so you want to make sure that you're, you know, getting everything and all that stuff. Plus, remember, over $50, use my coupon code, you're getting free shipping, you don't even have to worry about it. 
we really like this. We're going to put 12 in the cart. All right. Um, cardstock gets me in trouble, guys. You guys, I have so much cardstock in. I don't know the last time I've used any of it, but I need it all. I need it all. And that Happy and Rad I'm obsessed with. All of the license I'm obsessed with. All the Star Wars I'm obsessed with. Disney I'm obsessed with. Sean just... Literally, they Ryan and Sean went to go clean my craft room, and they're like, we need to buy a shed because there's nowhere to put this stuff. And I was like, don't throw it out. I might need it in five years from now, so don't get rid of it. It's very <laughs> important to me. It needs to be in my life. So this is all 40% off. Infusible ink is on their website, but you can't get it. It's only at Michael's. Uh, Maker Materials is all 40% off, and this is super awesome. Um, They've released this new Cricut chipboard craft that you can see a lot of people are making puzzles. Uh, so you definitely check that out. New stuff, even the aluminum sheets, you guys, these are already on sale and they're never, I mean, this is, these just hit the market. Um, the small little leather, leather is on sale, excuse me, geez. Um, and then of course, all my other favorite stuff. So printable materials, uh, all of that stuff is all on sale. I cannot stress it enough. Make sure to get some good stuff in your cart. Um, we have, look at this, 194, but that's not really true because look at this, this glitter stuff was $18. Man, glitter, you, anything you put the name Unicorn on, you can get so much money for it. So then um, you use my code, Ken, you get 10% off. If you're an Access member, you get 10% off. And look at this, like seriously, look at the discounts we're gonna get. So. The subtotal is 194 Retail value would have been around then $280. And then after discounts and everything, it's going to bring it down to like $150 for all of this. Nice. Nice. Okay. You can go back to us. Um, so there you go. I'm going to go yeah. look at your questions real quick. It's because it disappeared. Let's see. Hi, Jessica. Hi, Jessica. Oh, Linda. I don't know what a spending freeze is, but I should. <laughs> My cricket uh, or my uh, credit cards later. Love it when I, you know. Let's see here. Um, I don't see any of your guys' let's see. You guys are all talking to yourself. I just love it, like when you guys are always just talking, you know, amongst yourself. Um so is it better than a heat press? You guys, I will be honest with you on easy press versus heat press. If you are someone who owns a shirt business and you are making 40 shirts in a row with the same pattern on it and boom, 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 a heat press is probably what you're going to want to go with. An easy press is for a home-based crafter that's making shirts for their family or stuff. Not saying a business can't use it, yeah. um, but I definitely will say it's way better than an iron. I used to do all of my iron on with an iron and it always fell off in the washing machine. <laughs> so I love my easy presses. Mm -hmm. We use them all the time. Um, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't see the need for the mini at first, but I'm now warming up and saying, I'm never gonna make bows or stuff, but you never know. Yeah, you never know. But, but once I get it, we will do a comparison sure. to other stuff, but we're gonna do a whole new review around the easy press family. Blades are on sale. Isn't that exciting? Enabler alert. Um, I know, spending freeze. What is this whole spending freeze? Are the blades on sale? The, the normal blades, like the... Oh, so the new maker tools are not on sale. So what like the pe preparation blade, all of that, not on sale. Very sad. Preparation. Or yeah, not preparation age. That's yeah. completely different. All right, so um, I have a question for you, and I will be looking at the comments on this. Mm -hmm. A couple weeks ago and last week, we asked you guys on branded merchandise. Merch. So we are looking at uh, bringing out shirts and hoodies and all of that stuff through a Teespring, which is built into YouTube. It's super awesome. They take care of most of the work for me, but we can do Ken from the car stuff and shirts and stuff like that. When it comes to other things, I want to, for example, release a fan. Everyone says I want a fan or I want the ear foam ear you use and all that stuff. Sure. How important is it for my logo to be on there? And the reason I ask is I can put a logo on a fan. I don't have one because um, I just don't. So for example, uh, this is like a fabric fan. You can't put logos on this, mm -mm. but I could order like a fan of the month club. <laughs> <laughs> and do that or if you want a logo on it it would be a paper fan kind of like I gave 
at ChalkCon, which I don't have anymore. I don't think you do. I've given them all away. If there away. is one, there might be one in your office. Maybe. There could be one in the office. Mm -hmm. How important is that? Because I want to kind of know. We got responses all over the map. We are releasing uh, merch probably in the next month or so. And I just want to know, you know, would you guys rather do something where, you know, it's fun fans or our logos on it or our set, which is mm -hmm. fine. Just know that it would be, yeah, it would be a paper fan yeah. versus a fabric because right. we can't do it on fabric. No. And I think, I mean, yeah. there are some things that it's easy. Plus it costs more if you have to put a logo on it. Um, a few other things. So I was thinking of doing a, um, seriously like a, uh, you know, merchandise of the month box where it's like, could be a fan in there of the month or could be other logo merchandise because mm -hmm. a lot of people want a mystery box. Um, I am working with certain companies on a mystery box. So that is something I am looking at. Mm -hmm. um, I'm looking at other things, but when it came specifically to the branded uh, merchandise, anytime you add logo, the cost is going to go up mm -hmm. and stuff. And specifically on the fan, it's going to be a paper fan. I, I mean, which won't per se last the longest mm -hmm. type of thing. Ears are easy. I can get the foam ear and put whatever I want on those. That's easy and stuff. Simple so, um, logo on. See, I think logo is important too. I knew it. Who is that with you? This is Sean. That's me. Yes. Come and on. that's my nephew, Ryan. He's a brand new employee oh, yeah. that's going to be helping with Sean <laughs> and stuff. Oh, people are, are, are lighting my phone up. Um, so, okay. That's good to know. It's good to know. Um, and stuff. So awesome. Sweet. Sweetness. So the next thing I want to talk to you guys about is this channel specifically. So mm -hmm. we are in a transition and I want to know, we have been doing certain tests with this channel and we're noticing really the one video that is consistently gets most anyone to watch is our live videos where we literally don't do any crafts. <laughs> like, I'm feeling like this it's channel true. is more of a Ken from the car slash taste test slash take you on a, what like a vlogging, a vlogging a channel. A vlog. Like a vlogging yeah. channel. Or would you miss the crafting element? Or is it literally, we just want the lives? I really want your feedback on this because as things evolve, mm -hmm. um, I'm at the point where I'm gonna have to give some things up. Because yeah, I, I will shave my head like Brittany and have a meltdown and take an umbrella and shove it in someone. <laughs> Which is gonna be you, <laughs> let's be honest. <laughs> um, uh, let's see here. Need logos, yep. Yeah, I love that. So here's the deal. So I love live videos. Mm -hmm. Um, I'll be honest, you guys, it's not that I'm not passionate about paper crafting or vinyl and stuff. I still love doing that all. It's just, you have to come up with the project. You have to come up with the links. You have to do all that stuff. And a lot of our videos that aren't live, people don't engage with the links down below. And in mm -hmm. order for, you know, like anything in a business, you have to make up your mind what's going to be the best for the business and stuff. So I'm kind of like, you know, what do we do? and stuff. Mm -hmm. We we do have a new Chocotour channel, new Chocotour Facebook group, and that's my jam right now. It's no secret, you guys, I love Chocotour. Mm -hmm. I love the inspiration, I love um, the team I have and stuff, but it does because as our team get larger, it takes up more time, hence right. why we've brought you on and Ryan on, mm -hmm. but it's a lot of pressure, y'all, man. I am trying to carry four people's salaries, health benefits, now a 401k. I have panic attacks, y'all. Mm -hmm. I have to like breathe in and then I have vaccines. Let's talk about vaccines because here's the deal about vaccines. They don't tell you when you get a vaccine that I, your life I is going to suck. That's what they don't tell you. I know. I took a vaccine last Thursday and it is the cholera. So I don't get cholera because they said, oh, you don't want to have cholera no. because you will live in a toilet because it is, it's horrible. Like you, you basically are attached to a toilet. Guess what? All last week I've been attached to a toilet. Like, mm -hmm. I don't know the last time. No. Nope. You guys. I don't think I've ever seen you this I had to change ever. my boxers three times yesterday. <laughs> TMI? It's, it is, but is this seriously what vaccines do to you? 
Some or is it kids, just because it's, it's I had so kids. many? I think you had so many. I'm I'm surprised. I'd like to know what our friend Christine, because she had like all of hers all at once too. She is a trooper, man. She must be because. Or she hides it. I don't uh, hide it well. No. No. Nope. I think you did get a lot at once. Although, as you were ending it, then you all of a sudden get your cholera. Which no, is and which is a drink. And, and, it is a drink. Yeah, it's basically. Uh, sodium carbo- carbonate. Not good. And it's clear. And I wish I should have done a taste yeah. test for it. Not, no, good, not good because the, even the pharmacist said this is not a good. Com- let me let's let's chat about this. This is not a comforting fact. When you go to your pharmacist, pharmacist and you said, "Hey, I have the cholera," and they literally say, "Oh, we have never administered this to someone, and it's very new for us, so we have to read the instructions." Hmm. <laughs> oh. Yeah. You guys, I'm telling you, like. You got it, Rebecca. Tomorrow, it literally said on the paperwork, because Sean was, Sean's gotten to the point where he's like, you might need to go in because you were in the bathroom a lot, mm-hmm. and it is not good. And he and it said the side effect was only a 4%. 14. So you, I thought I said 4. Maybe I misread the parenthesis or something. So, lack of appetite, which. <laughs> Why could have I gotten that out? That side effect. No, I had to get the other one. Um, I think I'm just really sensitive to medication changes and vaccines. Mm-hmm. Can that be a thing? Sure. Sure can. Okay, so <laughs> I just keep telling myself I'm changing lives in Africa and that it'll be worth it. But it's been a rough two weeks with these vaccines. I get to find out. I need to call them today. So why have they haven't called me because I was supposed to have it oh, on it's, Tuesday. It is like a fine glass of Chianti. You're going to love it. I'm sure. And not only that, but seriously, they were like, we've never given this vaccine before. And don't trust your pharmacies. That's what I'm saying. Because they gave me a shot for rabies, and I thought I was done. And Sean literally is like, you need to go back to the, the, the pharmacy today to get your next rabies mm-hmm. shot. And I was like, what? They didn't tell him it was a, he thought it was a one shot one time and they were done. But no, no, the pharmacist, oh, there's no such thing. It's, you, have to, you have to have a series. And the only reason I'm getting a rabies shot is because I don't know if an animal might not bite me in Africa. Mm-hmm. So, Angela asked, why don't you get your stuff from your doctors? Some you did get from your doctors, and there are some that they don't do at the doctor's office anymore. That you have to go either to, um, like yellow fever. The only place in Spokane is at Safeway, because they're the only ones that can do it. And here's the thing about yellow fever. You want to hear my (laughs) predicament about yellow fever? We technically don't need it. But we are going to be in an airport for an hour and a half that is considered Mm -hmm. a yellow fever country. And there is stories on the internet that says if you do not have a vaccination card saying you got yellow fever, you are stuck in that airport. Guess whose luck would that be? Probably not in that port. It's probably the airport you're going to. No, Ethiopia won't let you leave their airport. Because oh. they check it when you're leaving. Hmm. So I think I might just forge one. I have to forge one. Yeah. Which we've been told you can do. Well, we haven't been told we can do that. <laughs> we just read stuff on the internet and we're pretty sure that they know everything. Yep. <laughs> because that's WebMD. WebMD is my doctor. Yeah. I'll just fold up all my papers like, yeah, got them all. Except Joe says, hey, it. now I'm a pharmacy tech. Pharmacy techs are wonderful, yeah, but I, like I feel bad for this pharmacy this pharmacy specifically because they literally saw all my prescriptions for all of the shots I needed and they're like where are you going and I was like Africa and they're like we know people that are going to Africa and then I'm like well I'm going to Malawi and they're like oh uh, yeah you need all of these and then I'm well, like if we truly were going to like um one of the yellow fever ones then obviously yes you have to get it but thank you Captain Obvious <laughs> jeez <laughs> Louise <laughs> obviously but I can't. So we are going to Africa September 20th through the 30th. Mm-hmm. Um, we did have our call of what to expect. Mm-hmm. How much can we talk about? I don't know. I don't want to talk about any of it. Okay. So uh, I'm very excited about the opportunity. It's just, it's, it's a lot of prep work. Yeah. I'll just say that. And then Sean yesterday tells me, oh, you probably shouldn't wear any blue or black or the TD things are going to get you. I'm like, Tsetse fly. Is this is what I have to deal with. I'm literally in the middle oh, trying to help team members. And he goes, you probably shouldn't wear blue or black 
in Africa, which, by the way, we have to wear long pants. It's a whole yeah, cultural thing, which, hello, I sweat all day long. And so, A, and I wear black because it makes you look skinny. And Sean's like, you can't wear that because the TT flies are going to get you. The T the ZZ flies will get your pee-pee. <laughs> that is literally what he said. ZZ no. flies will get your pee-pee. No, you can't wear it. No, no, no. Yes, you did. I did not, you said that way. I'm just saying. Why are we going to Africa? Kim says on Facebook. Hi, Kim. Why are we going? Okay, I'm oh, sorry, oh, Kari, sorry. Um, Kari, we are going to Africa because uh, Chaka Tour partners with a wonderful organization called wonderful. Lots of Love. And I have amazing viewers like you guys who came and um, bought, we did a Chakathon and we raised a lot of funds. So we were selected to go to Africa and actually go into the field and hand out lights. Mm -hmm. So I'm super excited for it's that most, part. It's mostly this one. It's the prep work I'm not yeah. excited about because yeah. You know, you don't get vaccines on a regular basis. You get maybe a flu shot. Vaccines, man, I tell ya. I felt like I had the flu. I got mm -hmm. hep A, hep B, DTAP, cholera. Flu? Flu. Which I have to get when I go through it. Um, tetanus, mm -hmm. rabies. Mm -hmm. And you're getting more rabies. More rabies. And, and I got the other one, the, the oh, malaria. Malaria. Malaria, which you don't start until we get two days before we get there. What's funny, he's on the antibiotic version of it. I'm on the actual malaria. Of course, they say they can get, you can get really weird dreams from that one. Do you want to know what I've gotten from the cholera? Yeah. <laughs> I, would, I would love weird dreams at this point. <laughs> Me and my toilet are best friends. I've <laughs> named him. I say good morning to him, and on every half hour, we have a little conversation. I don't know. Right now, that conversation is why. Why me? Why? Why? Or, oh, look, it looks the same going as does coming out. Yep. I'm telling you guys, it's rough. Have you raised enough money for me yet? Not no. Yet. So, I, um, and thank you, so, uh, Sue, for popping in that. There's a link that Sue Badinsky is putting in there. If you would like to donate to my cause, please do. And we thank you so very much. Karen goes, I got sick as the dog from Happy. I think two weeks ago when I got the first round of shots, I did. I felt like I had the flu for three days, and I think it was just... And then I made the wise choice of watching The Handmaid's Tale, which probably wasn't my best idea, but caught up on that. Lovely. That's not a motivational... Bula Bula virus? What's a... Don't even tell me about the Bula. I, I already have to worry about the TT flies. <laughs> it's not funny. <laughs> just the way you say it. TT flies. How do you say it? TT. It's, it's the T is How, all Why there. is it funny when I say TT, but it's not funny when you go ZZ? Tsi 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 tsi. It's a, it's like it's a TS. It's, I, know, it's I can't different. with him. I can't. I can't. Yeah, there are some it's people who some people really do have a, a problem with the uh, flu shots. Yeah, especially if you're allergic to eggs. To what? Eggs. If you're allergic to eggs, because oh, the, the I thought you said something different. No, 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 no. Nancy, when you have colonoscopies, the prep is the worst. Oh, I do remember that prep. What's worse about that prep Which is one? you have to drink like two gallons of that stuff. Oh. Colonoscopy prep. Oh, 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 yeah. It's like, and they're like, what flavor would you like? And you're like, there's flavors. And they're like, it really won't help. No. And that's what you have to, you have to find the, uh, the crystal light that has no dye in it. You can use that. That works. And there's a couple out there. I can't with you. Mm-hmm. But did you say there's another one that you know how to drink? I can't read that comment, Laura. That is cracking me up. You can't. Which <laughs> one? <Lauren? laughs> I can't with you guys today. I'm in a mood. I'm telling you what. Um, we are very excited about the trip. Mm -hmm. What I'm most excited about is helping people. But... Now I have people coming out and telling me I don't even want to talk about it because they're, it's just a different country mm -hmm. and there's different cultures. There's different, sure. we're not going to like where, you know, like if we were going to where Eddie Murphy was and coming to America in sure. his palace, that'd be different. That's a lot different. We are not. You're not. But I am very excited. Um, let's see here. So anyways, um, Take advantage of this sale. Oh, I forgot to talk about one other sale. Six, if for those of you who are Oracle fans, mm -hmm. which we know there's people out there, right now on our good friends over at 651 Vinyl, um, I might have to give you the link. 
through the rest of tonight, you can get uh, sheets of vinyl for 99 cents. Ooh, nice. Correct. So if you want to take advantage of it, it does end tonight. I can't believe I forgot this one. Um, let me grab that for you and that link because you want to take advantage because that one does end tonight. So it's 99 cents for Oracle, and I misspelled it. That's awesome. I put Orville, like the show. Um, so... It's, uh, you can get it for 99 cents. There we go. And let's place it right here. If, yeah. All right, guys. So, um, take advantage of the cricket sale. Sorry that the Ken from the car is so late. It was, I was in training all day. Um, we are going to be doing a chalk couture live. So for those of you who are my chalk couture fans, that will probably be more closer to six o'clock tonight on my other channel. Make sure you subscribe and love on that channel. Everyone wants to know, Ken, you used to have all these chalk tour videos. Where are they? They are now on that channel. You just can't find them because they used to be on Ken's creation. So they're in search results and now they're on a new channel. So mm -hmm. they are disappeared from search results, which is very yep. sad. Wah, wah. 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 Yeah. Very sad. Yeah. Let's see here. Um, I miss you guys on live. When are you getting back on? We're on a live right now, We're Jessica. On a live now. <laughs> are, is that, are you talking about Chalk Couture lives on that? Or are you talking about this live? Where's the car? Mary, the car's out in the garage. So we were going to do the car, but I wanted to show you desktop on how to take advantage of the sales mm -hmm. and stuff. Yeah. Um, and it's a little bit late. And then we're diving straight into a new live. So And Ryan's training on Switcher Studios. We're not taking small toys, but we are taking dumb dumps. So, Cricket, you bring up a wonderful point. So we actually had training around this because um, you just have to be careful. And they bring up a good point of, like, if you bring, like, toys and stuff, it can be overwhelming because the amount of people that are coming mm -hmm. up to get one. But it can also be where other people feel left out because they didn't come get one and you didn't bring enough. So right. there's a lot that's going into this trip that I wouldn't have thought on my own. So I'm very glad we're going with Watts of Love, who's done a ton of research and you know, they're the ones telling us, you know, certain things and stuff. So, oh, Jessica, tonight, the live will be at six o'clock tonight on my other YouTube. So that's yeah. like, I like to say, because yesterday I was up at 4 a.m., but I literally started writing my post and it was, I've been up since 4 a.m. And then in parentheses, I went, that's 5 a.m. Mountain, 6 Central and 7 Eastern. Everyone's like, why'd you do that? I was like, because now I, I'm, I'm trained. So that will be 6 p.m. tonight. 7 Central. Seven, seven mountain, mountain eight, eight central, eight, nine, nine eastern, and we're daylight time right now, which that doesn't matter. But I, you know, yeah, just so you know, just, just that time. Um, let's see here. I'll give them rabbit ears. I know, right? We want you to do that to us. The donation link. Um, let's see. The what link? Your donation link. To go to Watts Lab. Wrong with it? No, they were just asking for it again. We have to. Uh, um, so one of the great thing is um, is part of going on this trip is Sean has. Even though he's going with us, we're funding the whole Sean part of it because I was the one going on the chalk tour in. So we're funding his. And part of going, which I love, is Watts Love really encourages you to support mm -hmm. and fundraise. fundraise. So yes. this way we can give more lights. Yep. So of just going, we have to raise 4250 just for the Watts of Love part. 3000 of that is directly going to be lights we are giving out to communities. Yep. So 3000 of that is that the other 1250 is the your food, food your transport, lodging, well, not the airfare, but like lodging, lodging and all yes. that stuff. Mm -hmm. So um, anything you guys can do would be great. We are going to be doing another chalkathon and donating some of our, or uh, auctioning off some of our chalkathon or chalk tour pieces uh, later in August, early September. Mm -hmm. Right before we go to the Cameo 4 release party. Mm. Everyone's been asking about the Cameo 4. I can't wait to see it too. And then after that, we get back. We literally get back and then we go to Africa. And then if I come back from that, not, you know. Dead. Dead. Thanks, Ryan, for being so polite. <laughs> um, <laughs> knowing me, I'm just going to wander off. And I know I won't fall off a cliff. And I won't go in the water because there's cichlids and I don't like cichlids. They're afraid of you. 
They are not afraid of Sean took me to Mexico and he said, oh, get in the ocean, the fish are afraid of you. And then I get in the ocean and all these fish swarm me and I said, I thought you said they were afraid of him. The guys were like, oh no, here they're so used to tourists and tourists give them little peas or bread that they swarm you. And I had a panic attack and didn't move for an hour while this guy left me and went and snorkeled and was so excited because he found a Nemo. See? And then you guys are always like, be, be nice to Sean. He left me. In the water, grant you, I was only like three feet in water, but still. There was like huge angelfish darting between my legs. I was frozen in fear. And you left me to go see a Nemo. Mm. And then he brought up a cucumber thing. Ooh. No, that was in Cancun. I was, remember. That was at, um... I didn't get in the water in Cancun. I would have never gotten in the ocean in Cancun. Actually, not too many people did. We stayed in the pools. <laughs> I, pools I like. You yeah. can see to the ground of the pools. There is no... Um, you can see what's happening. Yeah. Uh, Cricket, the areas we are going to, to give out the lights, they do not have electricity whatsoever. Correct. Um, where we're staying is right on the uh, edge of, of the lake. There's a gigantic freshwater lake there. So there's a place there. It's, it's on TripAdvisor. Uh, it's got four stars, four point, four something. And they have electricity, but we have to get a universal converter so we can plug things in, charge things while we're there. Um, but everywhere else, because we have to travel from, from an hour to two hours to each of these places while we're there. But we always go back to our resort um, each night. Correct. Yeah. So I am super excited. We did look at the hotel we're staying at. There is electricity there, running water. It actually looks really cool. It's like a pottery place. I'm very excited about that. Um, so I'm very excited about it. It's just a lot of prep work mm -hmm. to go to certain countries, which I did not realize. Did you know hmm. that would be this much? He some, didn't. Of, some of it is like, eh, it's more than I thought. Oh, look at you guys. You did all my staging stuff there. Yeah, right there. Yeah. You guys have done so oh, much. Yeah. Ryan is a good, yeah. Mm -hmm. So I basically hired Ryan to keep Sean on focus. Because you guys want to know what a typical day is for me when I'm working and, you know, doing stuff? Sean, what are you doing? Oh, I'm working on my phone. Okay, well, what he doesn't know is I can see what he's doing on his phone because everything's attached to our Apple devices. He gets in what's called the endless video loop of Facebook, where he watches one video, one video, which is about a car usually. And the next thing I see Sean while I am working, trying to make money for our business, across the living room laughing. And I'm like, what? And he was like, you should have seen it. This mouse ran under a couch and then it was dead. dead, dead. I'm like, what are you watching? He's like, oh, I'm answering questions on your Facebook. <laughs> and I'm like, then why are you laughing? He's like, I just took a little break. Wow. Exactly right. Wow, see, see, I know it's abusive. <clears throat> You need to document this for, you need to, this needs to be seen on Netflix. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this needs to be seen. It's called, he is the silent abuser. See, look at, he knows. He already knows because he has to work with you too. I know. He's pretty good for me. Good, you didn't have him. Man. <laughs> <laughs> says you talk too much. Pools, he barely talks at all. I know, that's why that is a joke. Oh, I get Sharon, it. Sharon's like that. I didn't think they could hear me. Pam, my new chalk couture is literally, it's very creative. It is chalk couture. Sean, you just did something on Facebook to get an angry face, I'm saying. I I'm did? just what saying, did do? I don't know. They did not like something you did. You stabbed me. Did I stab you? Yeah, maybe it's because you stabbed them. So, all right, guys. My cousin lived on Amazon and got stung by a stingray. Don't. I can't right now with that. I swam with stingrays. It was the most terrifying experience of my Wait, life. Did you read the rest? No, I'm not going to. Oh, my. See, Nikki, no. This is why I go to Disneyland and Disney World. <laughs> and I really feel like Disney World... But you, you haven't can... been there yet. You haven't been there yet. I know, Sean. I know. But I could, you can go on an Africa Safari at Disney World. I know. You could do one at Disneyland. It's called the Jungle Cruise. Those animals are pretty realistic <laughs> nowadays. I know. I know. <laughs> oh, gosh. I can't tell you guys. Is Ryan's dad Ken's brother? Yes. It does. Does his brother look like Ken? Not no, really. not really. His, we need a brother, DNA, Ryan. He could be his, mine. His I don't know. His brother or his dad looks more like your uh, your dad. My dad. But then your oldest brother, Don, looks a lot like you and your mom and stuff. Did you break it already? Oh. You did. Oh, my God. Nancy. That has nothing to do with it. <laughs> yeah, so I don't know how Ryan ended up looking like me. 
I don't know. Because Ryan or Russ doesn't really look like me. No. So when I was younger, I found a picture of me in like high school, and there's a picture of you that we look identical. We do. And I show people, and they're like, "Isn't that you?" I was like, "No, no, (laughs) no, no. it's crazy." (laughs) Very weird. I mean, I mean, we're pretty close. Ryan goes monthly. Wow, to Disney World. What? My, that's she looks close. That's oh. what, I think oh, she looks okay. that's Florida. You know, I think a Netflix show for us would either be good or bad. I'm telling you right now, if Tana and Jake Paul can have a show on MTV, we should be able to have a show on MTV. Shouldn't we? We well, let the power go to our head, though. Hmm. Sean's already let the power go to his head. <laughs> There's times where I'm like, I'm going to do a quick live, and he's like, I'll get ready. And I'm like, no, it's just a quick live. And he's like, my people will want to see me. Ken. Yes, uh, you do. Maybe all the time. Maybe and all then the time. he was in his pajamas all day. Does he get changed for me, Ryan, or Jasmine? Nope. But for you guys, he rushes upstairs, usually changes, dyes his goatee to make sure he doesn't oh, look I, old. I need to shave, though. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. But she can grow here. Mm-hmm. And he made Ryan change. She said he, he wasn't presentable. No, he said, I have something on my shirt I want to show. And I said, okay, let me go get you yeah, a shirt. Yeah, for my people, of course. Her. What did he have on his shirt? I don't know. A Was stain. It? Uh, yeah, something that we oh, eat earlier. Oh, my gosh. I can't with you. All right, guys. We are going to let you go. Don't forget mm-hmm. to check out all those links. I'm so sorry. Oh, wait. I saw another question about brother. Oh, no. That was no. about my brother, not the yeah. brother scan and cut. Um, so if you want to take a look, we are making a fun gnome board. Yes. This is a fun one. multi What are we doing? All I know, I saw the gnome thing, so I know we're doing that. But I, what you're doing with it, I Do know. you see what I do with it? Oh, this is a fun one, guys. You just wait. And then, no, do you want to know, hey, gnomes. do you want to know what I'm going to do? You want to know what the best thing to do with Sean during a live is? Hmm? If we just leave him alone, he <laughs> freaks out. Really? Oh, yeah. I also know what I'm talking about. He freaks. He sits all, all literally, like, I will be like, I just have to go, and he'll go, um, so yeah, today it was hot, <laughs> and Ken will be here back in one sec. <laughs> like, he just doesn't like it. It's so funny. Ryan has people. He does. He does have people. He's big. Stop breaking your pants. I know, Nancy. Still works a little bit, I guess. Shades of Grey? Isn't that yeah, a naughty gray, shirt? Gray, you know, oh, not the movie Shades of Grey. No. I don't like Wasn't that, that Shades that was, of Grey? 50 Shades of Grey. Why 50? I never read the book. I didn't, I didn't either. I didn't see the movie. Why gray? Can someone explain this to me? Why is it gray? I don't know. Because I, mean, I didn't know that there was 50 out. shades. Maybe I need to read that book. Mm-hmm. I do know that book produced like its own generation of kids. Because like... I'm sure. Did you watch the movie? <laughs> no. No. Yeah. I had no intent <laughs> of that. <laughs> Primo's girl goes, are you still doing a No More Fairy Garden? If you have not found out this about Ken. I have moments, and I think it's because I have ADHD, but literally, we will literally be watching a movie, and I said, Sean, I just watched on YouTube Fairy Gardens, and we're going to make one. I literally drop everything, go to Michael's, spend $200 on it, and never... 200 We have We have all our... It's still here. That's how much I'm making Yeah. <laughs> oh, his name was Christian Gray. Oh, my God. Oh. That's what I thought. I thought his name But was then why Smith. 50 Shades? I don't know. Because he's obsessed with himself. I can't. I can't right now. I don't know. So, um, we do have a fairy garden coming. We're and by that I mean it's not just going to be Sean year. standing in a garden. It's actually <laughs> going to be. That's why you hired me. It's actually, we have the terracotta pots and. And the, all the little goody things. But. This year, Sean didn't let me plant flowers, so I don't really have any reason to put mm. it out anywhere because it's too time-consuming for us to water them. Yeah, sometimes. I can't with you. I know. Oh, it's not worth reading? Okay, good to know. It's not worth reading. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, we will see you. What time is it? Uh, it's 508. 508. Okay, so we will be live on that channel. Once again, Ken's Creations Chocolate Tour will be live there at Six ish. Yes. It should be a lot of fun because I we have a lot to talk about that. Um, I'm telling you. So, um, Ryan, you you are you getting paid enough? I'm not even getting paid. He doesn't get paid until he produces money. Mm. That's how we work. We're a full 100% commission job. Sean doesn't get paid either. No. Nope. Jasmine gets paid. <laughs> yeah, she gets paid. Nice. Yes. 
Your family, you do it out of love. I do. Not him. Oh. You do it out of out of it because you just like living this lifestyle we have created. <laughs> we're the cra- we're like the Tana and Jake Paul of crafters. Uh, I guess. <laughs> We need a petition like MTV for our own show. They'll take yeah. anyone now. Yeah, they'll take anyone now. They'll take us. All right, guys. So we'll see you there in about uh, an hour over on that channel. Have a great night, guys. Thanks, everyone. Bye. Bye-bye. He just tripped. Who did? Ryan. Oh. Do you know how to stop this? Mm-hmm.